Now, many of you know I've been traveling recently. I was in India. It was an incredible experience. I met so many of you guys. Yes, the Unbox Therapy viewers. Sunglass shopping in India. Somebody told me that this place is 150. Yeah, they told me that. 220. Yeah, 220. This is my first experience at Indian McDonald's. Maharaja Mac. It's really spicy. Yeah, it's good though. The international family in general had a great experience. Now, one of the reasons I was out there was to help launch this particular device, the Star Wars Limited Edition OnePlus 5T. Now, many of you know I've been using that device for a while. It's right over here, but of course, it's just the standard 5T. This device here has in many ways been inspired by the film. Ooh, oh my. I was told that the white on the back here, inspired by one of the final scenes in the film, they visit this planet with a really sandy kind of ground. What was the name of the planet? Will, look up the name of the planet where the final battle scene is. The Star Wars nerds are so angry right now. They are mad. Cruit, Kermit, Crate! The planet is called Crate. There's texture on here, all right? A little more grippy, the red Star Wars logo. You'll see the silent do not disturb switch, metallic red color with the texture, of course. The volume rocker as well as the power switch and the SIM tray are in black. A familiar look on the front. The standard 5T, a darker black reflective OnePlus logo, a silver metallic. On the standard 5T, you can kind of see the antenna on the top and bottom. On the limited edition, you do not see the antenna bands at all. Kylo Ren inspired case, inspired by his helmet in fact. Star Wars The Last Jedi. This is, if you are very serious about your Star Wars fandom, the dash charge brick, USB type C, some stickers too. Not just OnePlus stickers, but Star Wars The Last Jedi as well. This is where things get kind of interesting because inside the box here, there's a bit of an Easter egg. Now, when I was at the event, they apparently said they spent all this time on this particular piece of paper. And I was like, well, what's the big deal? There's a tiny little poem on the back. Strive to rule the galaxy, care to choose your side, and so on. Now apparently there's more here than initially meets the eye. If you look at the first letter of each sentence and read it downwards, scribble with pencil. Am I supposed to scribble this with pencil? Oh, found it. Something down here. There's some words being uncovered here. Whoa, find the secret compartment and check the weather forecast on Atch2, and we have Willy Do's attention now, big time. Okay, there's a secret compartment in the box, I guess. Is it in the box? Oh, it's here. This is the bottom of the box. Look at this. Yes. Jack, you remember this kind of a thing. I know what this is. You know what this is, Jack. We're gonna come back to this in a moment. There's a bunch of custom wallpapers. Kylo Ren option, black and red. Those soldier dudes, the trooper helmet. That's the death trooper, right? Don't you remember? This one has the beef with Finn. Okay, never mind. You kind of have to have that to go with it since it is a special edition. All the quick toggles are red now, red and black, including when you go to settings here. Check that out, standard 5T here. So that's the difference there. So if you want to see some camera testing and some other functions of the 5T, you can go watch my original 5T unboxing video. Time for us to look at this Easter egg. Folds out like this, goes on to here, comes down and kind of locks it in like that. And then what, you think this piece goes on top? I think that's ready to go like that. The card told me, check the weather forecast. So I'm gonna check the weather here. Hatch two. Okay, here we go. Yes! Put the holographic device on the screen. Keep the prism at eye level. Whoa! May the force be with you. How about that for an Easter egg? Everybody else, step your game up. I got the prism, I got the hologram with the Star Wars vibe. I mean, you saw the Leia hologram. You remember the classic scene. This is deep. You got the OnePlus logo. That's a true collaboration. I mean, don't just slap the logo on. You've got to embed the culture into it. And that's what they did there. 
So there you have it, the OnePlus 5T limited edition Star Wars, a very compelling and unusual unboxing experience with the Easter egg and the pencil. Since I picked this thing up while I was in India, what a time I had. I did shoot some video. I'm gonna pile it all together, show you guys the experience, stick around and be ready for that. It really was an amazing trip. Today's episode of Unbox Therapy has been brought to you by Whitestone Dome Glass, a screen protector that you can finally install easily with no air bubbles. None of those dust particles, you know the issues. If you've ever installed a screen protector before, it's not that much fun. Now they've gotten a lot better. They're made out of glass and you have these phones with curved displays. That's a bit of an issue with a lot of screen protectors, not with the dome glass. Full cover with no lifting. They make it for the iPhone 10, the iPhone 7, 8 Plus, the S8 Plus, a Note 8. They make them for all kinds of devices, so you could check that out through the link in the description. But what really makes these special to me, you can install this dome glass by using the installation jig that is in the box. That's right, I said jig. You didn't come here expecting me to say that, but I did. Kind of this little contraption where you place the phone in and it kind of does the work for you to a certain degree. Then afterwards, you use this UV LED lamp to kind of solidify the whole process. Okay, so there you have it, finished installation super clear glass screen protector, not a single air bubble in sight. You spend all this money on a device, throw a protector on, it's terrible. But not if you pick up one of these. The iPhone 10 is the one that I installed. They make it for many more. I'll link them down in the description. Thanks to them for sponsoring this episode. And if you're worried about your glass, get yourself the dome glass. Protect yourself with the dome, if you know what I'm saying.